From water polo to volleyball to track and field, if the thought of Olympic physical exertion is not enough to wear you out, staying up late for it will. It's tough to stay up late and then get up at uh, 5.45 the next morning and go to work, but yeah, I've, I've been hanging in there. Jeff Schatzman is a fishing captain staying up past his bedtime for the last week and a half. Well, last night was 1 o'clock, but then I'm ready to pass out. <laughs> it's keeping me awake, but I'm dying to go to bed, but it's just uh, you're just watching these things, and it's just unbelievable the things that you're seeing. Contractor Carlos Gonzalez was coming in and out of consciousness watching competitions last night. The reaction on the television just waked me right back up. Teddy Orozco says staying up till 1 in the morning to watch soccer does it make him tired? It gives me energy by lo looking at all these uh, athletes uh, working that hard. So, how do you survive these two weeks? You just kind of run on automatic. <laughs> you, you start out with a few extra cups of coffee in the morning. <laughs>